I'm Robert Wickens, um, and I will be driving in the Michelin Pilot Challenge with Brian Hurd Autosport. Yeah, it's something that uh, kind of started as fun. La last year, Brian asked me if I'd be interested in driving a race car again. Um, previously, I had raced an Indy car and raced um, in Europe for about 10 years. So it was uh, something that I was couldn't say no to. And luckily, with the help of uh, Michael Johnson, Brian Hurd Autosport had a, a car already fixed with hand controls and something that just came to fruition. So, yeah, so May 2021, we arranged a, a track day where I got to drive a race car again for the first time since my accident in 2018. And it was, uh, it was a lot of fun. It was a rainy, miserable day, but there was still a, a big smile on my face. And yeah, it was all, all thanks to uh, Hyundai and Brian Hurd Autosport. I mean, getting back into competition is the, probably the biggest thing that excites me. I mean, I've, I started karting when I was seven years old and it's just like you're competing, you're competing and thankfully I was, I was quite gifted in motorsports um, and yeah, just winning that, that like almost like ecstasy that you feel of, of winning and the adrenaline that comes with it was uh, you can't compare to anything else and being out of the car, out of, out of a race seat for three years now, it's been, it's been really challenging. And, I'm still involved in motorsports, um, working with the IndyCar team and, and being a consultant and a driver coach there and still trying to stay, stay in the loop of, of motorsport, but actually driving nothing compares to it. I think the system that we're developing now um, for the 2022 season is going to be a lot more as I remember driving, where your hands are properly on the wheel and, and more, more sit stuff are on the backside of the steering wheel, which will leave a lot more space to talk to the team on the radio, adjust your switches, anything else, because you'll actually have more, more opportunity to do that stuff. Well, I mean, I think the Michelin Pilot Challenge is an incredibly competitive championship. You know, you, you see it time and time again. I think Brian Hurd Autosport is the benchmark team of, of uh, where you need to be in that series. Um, but then, you know, there's drivers like, like Mark that I've known my entire career. You know, he was always that step ahead of me on, on the road to being a professional driver and I know what he's capable of um, and it's just there's 10, 15 of, of the equivalents of him dri driving in this championship so I'm, I'm happy to be a part of it. I mean it's it's a luxury <laughs> you know it's, it's not every day you can jump straight into the championship winning team you know it's doesn't matter what category you're in if it's grassroots karting or if you're working up into junior formulas you know you always want to have the best opportunity to win a championship and uh, Brian Hurd Autosports and the Michelin Pilot Challenge is that team they're they're dominant they've won three years in a row and there's no reason why they're slowing down anytime soon so I think it's going to be a great opportunity for me to hopefully uh, have some strong results right out of the box and you know I felt like I was really hitting my prime as a driver prior to my accident in 2018 and I want to hit the ground running, you know. The goal is pretty simple. I want to win the first race and just move on. I'm, I'm not here to gain experience slowly and surely and hopefully fight for a championship. Like, I want to win the first race and I want to win the championship. It's not, I'm not, <laughs> I'm not here just for, to tick a box. You know, I want to keep competing and, 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 and win again.